Hey everybody, it's me, Connie. I just want to get on here and show you my new listing on um, Etsy. I'm so excited. I uh, can't wait to kind of give you a preview of it all. There's only five sheets, so it's really, really pretty. Um, let's see. There's this coffee stain paper, as you can see. I love the way my my paper had turned out, so I thought, why not share with you guys? So I printed it on both sides. This paper that I printed it on is just 20 pound card, uh, uh, not cardstock, copy paper. It's just 20 pound uh, copy paper, but look how pretty that uh, printed out. I just love that. Okay, so let me show you. This right here, let me let me find the okay. It is supposed to be printed landscape. So this is what happens when you forget. Oh no, it's supposed to be landscape. You can see when before you print what it's gonna look like. And I was like on the phone, really busy and trying to multitask on all of these different things. And so this is what it printed out like. But I still have it on the back, so don't think I'm not going to use this for something, because I will. <laughs> but this is what it looks like on landscape. This right here, this this doily is really huge, you know. But, so does it count as a doily? I mean, how, how big is a doily? Is there a... Um, where it stops being a doily at a certain size. I don't know. Anyway, this right here is very, very special to me because it was something my mother and her mother, I've, um, I've always seen it at somebody's house. It was either her house or my mom, you know, when I was a little bitty girl. So this is pretty special. And I think that, you know, when you make a page, you can do so much with this. It's really, really pretty. It's got, uh, it's a, color I think that would go with everything and I printed the coffee stain on the back and um, the doilies they have the coffee stain underneath them so the background is real pretty as well you can do whatever you want with this this is really pretty you could tear it and use it in your collages and and stuff like that this is really really pretty it's very special to me uh, matter of fact, all of the doilies that you see were my mother's or grandmother's and stuff like that. So, this is so pretty. Oh, this is going to make, make a beautiful page. Look at that. That would even make a beautiful cover. And then you just put something stuff on it. Look how pretty. I tried to center that so nicely so that this would be the middle. And you could just really make a beautiful page with that. That is just gorgeous. And then here's the back. I printed my coffee, the coffee stain on the back as well. So there's that. It's so pretty. Here is some vintage uh, ribbon that my um, mother-in-law gave me. And I just did it on one side so that when you make a page, you've got this already on your on the side. Um, I do have it with it this way as well, but... Um, I'm still in the process of trying to figure some things out with the Etsy, so y'all forgive me, but there's just going to be five pages on this one um, right now. But um, I will be uploading an <clears throat> another batch very, very soon, so um, um, be ready for that. So there is this. This is so gorgeous. That is just, I love the paper. I love the paper. I just think it's so beautiful. It turned out so nice. This was a very small section of, I wish I could have covered the whole page, but it's not big enough for me to cover the whole page. So you have this little bit right here of the coffee stain uh, poking out, but you could cut that off if you wanted to. But um, this was a very old um, tablecloth and I just have a small section of it. And this is all, I mean, it barely fit on, um, my scanner in order to do this but i just think that is absolutely beautiful that is so pretty look at that as a page you can write on this it's so pretty and then the the coffee stain paper just kind of lifts itself up behind it very nicely that is just 
so, so gorgeous. And then I printed the coffee stain on the back. So you do get this uh, coffee stain uh, as well. So you get the, the tablecloth. You get the ribbon, the one with the ribbon on one side. You get the round doily, which would make a great cover. Or just in the middle of your um, journal. That would be so pretty. And then um, this one right here, which was my mother's. I just, I'm just in love with that. It's, it's special to me. It, uh, let me just say that. It's special to me. But you can, um, this would be great to tear up and add to certain things. And then you get the coffee stain paper. You get the coffee stain paper. I print it on both sides. So, um, anyway, so there it is. Um, this one's going to be printed as a landscape, and so will this one, I'm, I'm pretty sure. But the rest of them are portrait style, and they are JPEG, so there's that. So, very, very pretty. I'm excited about it. I think... Um, I think you will like it. I think those of you that like a vintage look in your journals, I think that um, this is something that you might enjoy. So I hope you like this. Go check it out. I'll leave the uh, link down below. And um, yeah, just enjoy. It's just really pretty paper. Um, I print the coffee stain on the other side of whatever I print on the front. So it's really nice. See this? Look. See how that coffee stain kind of comes through the uh, the doily? I just love it. I think that is so cool. That is so, so pretty. That is just, I just love it. Love it. Love it. This would make, you could print this on cardstock and then cut a section out. And that would just be um, a pretty tuck you know, into something. You could cut these, cut this up and fold it and put it in a little pocket or a little envelope and, and have the coffee stain on the other side. That is just beautiful. So I hope you enjoy this. I am really excited about it. I think it's really beautiful. And um, be sure and come to my Facebook page and join and excuse me, and let me see what you've done with it. Let me see uh, all the little projects that you do with it. I would just love that. If you make little inserts and little collages or clusters and stuff like that, I would love to see it. This would be perfect for that. So anyway, thanks for hanging out. I'll see you soon. Be sure and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe and hit the little bell. And um. You'll get to see me again real soon. I've got a lot of things uh, cooking, and I do have more of these papers coming. Um, I, oh, gosh, I have quite a bit more coming, so I'm excited. I'm going to try to integrate it into one bundle so that you're not just getting five, okay? So I'm going to try to put it in a, a bigger bundle for you. So I hope you enjoy. God bless, and we'll talk real soon. Bye, everybody.